Mary Buffett and David Clark's book, Warren Buffett and the Interpretation of Financial Statements, The Search for the Company with a Durable Competitive Advantage, serves as a guide to understanding Warren Buffett's methodical approach to evaluating financial statements in pursuit of identifying solid investment opportunities. This work builds upon the teachings of Buffett's mentor, Benjamin Graham, particularly drawing inspiration from Graham's earlier work, The Interpretation of Financial Statements, 1937. By combining foundational knowledge from Graham with Buffett's personal insights and investing acumen, the authors aim to make Buffett's formidable strategies accessible to both novice investors and experienced enthusiasts. The central premise of the book is to educate readers on how Buffett analyzes financial statements, such as income statements and balance sheets, to pinpoint companies that possess a durable competitive advantage. This competitive advantage, according to Buffett, is critical for ensuring a company's long-term success and therefore the success of any investment. The book delineates a series of principles and strategies that Buffett employs, enabling investors to distinguish between companies with promising prospects and those that present significant risks. One key takeaway from the book is Buffett's guidance on interpreting an income statement and balance sheet. The authors distill Buffett's time-tested dos and don'ts, highlighting common pitfalls investors should avoid. For example, Buffett is wary of companies with excessively high research and development costs, as these can indicate a lack of a durable competitive advantage and can burden future profitability. The book advises investors to be cautious of such expenses, emphasizing the importance of assessing whether these costs are leading to sustainable value creation. Another critical aspect covered by the authors is the role of debt in evaluating a company's financial health. Buffett advocates for prudent management of debt, warning against companies that carry an overwhelming debt load. According to his philosophy, too much debt can be detrimental, increasing financial risk and potentially jeopardizing a company's longevity. The book underscores Buffett's cautionary stance on debt, advising readers to scrutinize a company's leverage to avoid endangering their investments. Furthermore, the book elaborates on the financial ratios and calculations Buffett uses to identify companies with durable competitive advantages. These financial metrics are vital tools in Buffett's investment arsenal, helping him to filter out companies from a broader market pool. The authors stress the importance of mastering these calculations to effectively gauge a company's worth and potential for sustaining competitive dominance. Buffett's approach also involves evaluating how financial statements can reflect a company's intrinsic value. The book delves into methodologies to assess a company's value beyond mere market price, instilling the idea that a deep understanding of financial statements is indispensable for estimating true worth. This valuation process is portrayed as a blend of art and science, requiring both quantitative assessment and qualitative judgment. Moreover, the authors address the types of companies Buffett avoids, regardless of how attractively they may be priced. Companies lacking a strong competitive edge, or those operating in industries with rapid technological changes, are typically eschewed by Buffett. The book provides insights into Buffett's criteria for excluding certain investments, reiterating that not every seemingly cheap investment is a wise one, especially if the fundamentals do not support long-term sustainability. Ultimately, Mary Buffett and David Clark aspire to equip readers with the skills necessary to emulate Buffett's investment strategies. By mastering his methods for financial statement analysis, readers can develop the acumen needed to spot potential winners in the stock market. The book promises to steer investors towards companies that will be successful in the future, while cautioning them against those likely to falter. Warren Buffett and the Interpretation of Financial Statements positions itself as a modern classic in investment literature, complementing other notable works like The New Buffetology and The Tao of Warren Buffett. It aims to be an essential resource for anyone seeking to understand and apply Buffett's enduring principles for financial statement analysis and investment. You can listen to the full audiobook for free or buy this book by following the URL in the description.